Hey you guys, Wayne here from HG Tech Videos. Today we're going to do a quick video. We're going to show you how to set up the new Echo Show from Amazon. And uh, we plugged it in and the first screen is um, basically connect to a Wi-Fi network. So let's go ahead and do that. We're going to connect to our Larry H. Parker. So we've got a touch screen which is really cool. Put in our little Wi-Fi password. It's kind of funny. Made it as a joke. Like Larry H. Parker commercials. <laughs> So it is pretty cool to have a touch screen on the Echo. Obviously, the older version, um, you've got to use the app on your smartphone, but it's pretty cool to be able to just connect. Um, and no, that is not me. All right, let me go ahead and set up my account. So we'll go ahead and set this up, and we'll be right back. All right, so we uh, went ahead and put in our um, uh, basically Amazon login information for amazon.com and now we're going to go ahead and select our time zone download the latest Alexa app all right so we've uh, downloaded the uh, echo app on our phone here and we're going to go ahead and open it up first thing I ask you to do is to sign in so let's do that all right, so we're signed in here. We've got a little intro video. Um, you can now call and message with friends through your uh, Echo devices. We're just gonna go ahead and hit started. Hit get started. I'm Wayne. Uh, let's see. So this is I set this up on a secondary phone, so I'm just gonna put up someone else. I'm Wayne too. Jam. Okay, continue here. Uh, let's see. Allow Alexa to peri allow Alexa to periodically upload your contacts. I'm gonna hit later for that one. Yeah, verify the phone number. All right, so we've got that uh, our phone number set up. Our next page here is loading conversations. This is now you can call and message your friends. And so now that we're done, on here it is saying continue. So this knows that we have set up the app. So we're going to go ahead and hit continue. Amazon processes and retains audio interactions, other data in the cloud to provide improved services. Alexa allows purchasing by voice using your default payment and shipping settings. You can require a speakable confirmation code and turn off voice purchasing in your Alexa app or Amazon.com. Alexa also allows you to call and message your friends and contacts. So this is kind of interesting here. Um, it's saying that it's it automatically is sort of saving audio and interactions in the cloud, which I'm not that... I don't feel too good about so obviously we're gonna have to go into settings and turn some things off so that we can kind of control what's being recorded uh, it is cool that you can set up your speakable confirmation code so that not just anyone can just buy something through your um, echo show so we'll definitely have to get into the settings and kind of see which ones are recommended to turn on and turn off we'll go ahead and continue for now uh, firmware updates we're going to hit install. That's going to be another few minutes, so we'll come back when that's done. All right, and we're back. That did, oops, sorry. That did take about uh, 10 minutes, took a while. But, uh, all right, let's see what's up. Introducing Amazon Echo Show. It's everything you love about Alexa, but now she can show you things. Play movies from Amazon Video, view your photos, or see what's on your calendar and to-do list. And now there's a new way to be together. Make hands-free video calls to friends and family. Like this. Alexa, call Tina. You can also message or call someone on their supported Echo device or the Alexa app on their phone. Ready for some music? Echo Show fills the room with bold stereo sound. Alexa, show today's most popular song. Here are popular songs. Alexa, play number two. And with Amazon Music, you can follow along to the lyrics of your favorite songs. Alexa helps you take control of your busy life. 
Alexa, show me sushi restaurant. Here are a few nearby popular ones. You can watch movie trailers or even watch your favorite shows and movies from Amazon Video. Alexa, play the Grand Tour. Alexa is always getting smarter. To get a list of things to try, just ask, Alexa, what can I say? And when you want to go back to the home screen, say, Alexa, go home. Enjoy your new Echo Show from Amazon. So pretty interesting. What I didn't know is uh, that you could now play movies on here, which is interesting. And also the stereo sound. Those are two things that... Uh, Right off the bat, I didn't know about. So I'm curious to try that out. Um, it's going to be a test to really see what is... Um, what's necessary. You know, like, this sounds like this device does a lot. But how many things am I actually going to use is the real question I need to figure out. Um, let's see, we got a little offer here. 30-day trial of the... Echoes mu uh, Music Service, Music Unlimited. I'm going to say not now because I actually pay for Google Music. So um, I really don't think you need more than one your music Echo service. Kind of wish you could sync like your uh, Google Music or Apple Music through here. Obviously, they want to push their service, so they won't. But it'd be nice if you could. Um, anyway, we're all set up, guys. And um, we've got a nice little touch screen here of uh, some basic things. And... Um, at this point, we'll have to really play around with it and really see what we can do. So we'll definitely have some more videos to come. Um, Alexa, go home. So that's kind of cool. Again, main thing I use it for is uh, Pandora. So let's try that real fast before we end the video. Alexa, play Mary J. Blige Pandora Station. Getting your Mary J. Blige radio station from Pandora. And that's probably the main thing I use my Echo Dot for right now. So uh, if it's just for music purposes, Alexa, pause music. Like, I have to find a lot more things to do with this. Alexa, pause music. <laughs> Alexa, stop music. She wouldn't listen at first. I had to regulate. But uh, anyway, um, more videos are to come. We're going to tell you our real uh, first thoughts. What we really think about this thing and if it's worth it to buy. So we'll definitely keep an eye out. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you like, favorite, and share if it was helpful. And make sure you also subscribe to HG Tech videos. Have a good one.